All right, boys and girls, today is day three of our second step activity, uh, and we're going to be talking about things that are the same. We're going to play a game today with these animals. Okay, so let's take a look at all the animals I have on the table, the reptiles and the animals. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at our snakes right now. Tell your parents what is the same about these snakes. Take a close look. All right. If you said they both have tongues, red tongues sticking out, that shows that they're the same. If you both said they both have green on them, you're right, that's what makes them the same. But now let's talk about what makes them different. Tell your parents what makes them different. You're right, this snake is much bigger than this snake. This snake is smaller. That's what makes them different. They're also moving in a different way. This snake is more coiled up, where this one's more outstretched. Very good. Let's take a look at the horses, the horse and the zebra. They're both, they both have four legs. They both have manes and tails, but what makes them different? Let's take a look. Explain it to your parents. What makes those different? Sure, our pony has hair where our zebra's hair is made out of just plastic. And they're different, even though they both look almost the same with four legs, they're different animals altogether. This one is a horse and this one is a zebra. All right, let's focus our attention now on the frogs. <clears throat> we have two different frogs. They both have four feet. They both look like they're ready to jump. They both have big eyes poking out of the side of their heads. But yes, they're different colors and have different shapes and designs on their skin. And last, we have two little lizards down here. They're both, they're about the same size. One's just a little bit smaller. They're both green. This one's a dark green, and this one's a light green. But what makes them different is this one has stripes on it with white, and this one is all solid. So that's what makes them same and different. All right, what I want you to do today is I want you to go around your house and see if you can find some items that could be the same, similar items like I did. I found two snakes and I found two lizards and two frogs and two animals that have similarities. And I want you to explain to your parents what makes them same and what makes them different. All right, boys and girls, I hope you have fun with that activity. Send me some pictures so I can see what things you found around your house. Bye-bye.